he will see this afternoon. Santa Cruz at two and three in the blue. Fort Wayne, they've dropped their last two. One and three overall, they're in the white. And they take the opening possession. Then Robinson just seems to float to the rim and he picks up the first two of this contest. A steal out in front. Here's Josh Gray, the easy lay-in. Josh Gray uses the screen. LeCue hops into a three and knocks it down. 17 minutes, but scored 19 points yesterday. Before the smile at each bucket, it was LeCue knocking it down from deep. Smile Geach backing his way in. He brings it up, guarded by Mannion. An opening underneath, a great feed, and then the follow. It was Robinson cleaning up the miss from Brissett. Robinson has started two for two in this contest. Racing up the floor, Brian Bowen the second. Without numbers, off glass and in. Forced four turnovers turning into the offense. Smile Geach lost it. His loss was Bowen's gain. A rebounder, a rim protector, and a much needed inside presence for Fort Wayne. They are running to LeCue. What a start for Jalen LeCue. Ball is loose, LeCue is there. Right down the lane, attacking the rim, and lays it up and in off the glass. Three of five from the field. One of the best shot blockers in the league when he is on the floor and healthy. LeCue trailing, Euro step in the paint. It's not there, but the left hand for O'Shea Brissett is. Using the screen, Poe in the second, sticks it. Fort Wayne sprints it out to a good start. Naz Mitru Long throws it to the corner for a triple. Jeremy Lynn still has it leaning in, and it lips out. Offensive rebound and a reset, and an opportunity for Jordan Poole to cash in. Baseline and Mitru Long sneaks it in. Wesson for three. Back to single figures. Fort Wayne led by 14 in the opening quarter. LeCue back to work. Nico Mannion straight away. He played 17 minutes yesterday in his return to the lineup in over a year. Missing the three and Mannion. That's a proper way to let out some frustration. Cruz struggling in that first quarter offensively, shooting just 31% from the field. At one point they trailed by 14, but they've got back into this one. Dusty Hannes, Alan Smilagich, Nico Mannion, Isaiah Reese, and Eli Pemberton, the five out there. Just underway in the second quarter, Reese left it short. The rebound down to Gray for Fort Wayne, pushing three on two. Terrific transition. Bowen the second lays it in. We play on. Lynn, the cutter, Pemberton. Seven forty to go, first half. Six point Matt Ants lead, and it extends to eight. How they deal with adversity in a back-to-back -back environment. They started four and zero. They were four close games. Brian Bowen, the second first player in this game into double figures. He has nine, or excuse me, twelve on five of eight shooting.
hanging and hitting. Fort Wayne has been living in the paint. Half of their points have come from there. On the kick out to Lynn, left wide open from deep, and he drains that one. Jalen LeCue, and now it's Robinson. He'll try his luck. Hannes terminates the dribble. Wesson, all the way in. Deep look, and it's drained. Jordan Poole. Jeremy Lin keeps the dribble. Underneath the basket, up and in. Lynn was scratched yesterday with back soreness, came off the bench today and has been productive. There's Brima on the interior. Santa Cruz looking for somebody to join Poole in double figures. Jalen LeCue scoops it in. Two have led the way offensively. LeCue on assignment from the NBA. While Bowen the second is in his second year on a two-way deal. LeCue splits the gap. Teen regular season games played over 25 days. This is game six for Santa Cruz and the fifth for Fort Wayne. Level of 11 from the floor. Josh Gray working the baseline. It lipped out. In the back corner of your screen on the Fort Wayne side, it appeared to me to Brimo was trying to get loose. O'Shea Brissett. Wesson fumbled it away. Robinson uses his length to score over Poole. Also time with the New Jersey Nets, Utah Jazz, Detroit Pistons, and the Hawks. Brian Bowen the second backs it out. Eight on the timer. Whips it inside and O'Shea Brissett can lay it in. Off of 17 Santa Cruz turnovers. Left all alone inside Caleb Wesson. The Q, Wild, Brima, offensive glass. Another chance at it. And the third opportunity is the charm. Brima providing resistance, but it's over the top of him. Couldn't convert in transition. Now it's Poole spinning the other way, sizing up Brima. Wrap around to Lynn. That's a transition triple. This is Poole creating separation and sticking a three. Poole all the way in. Poole, feeling it. Have the Warriors back in this one. Lynn, wide open paint. The floater drops down and won. A collision of bodies underneath the hoop. Off the dribble. Six seconds left on the shot clock. O'Shea Brissett. Stolen away. LeCue, three on one. This time a better connection with Robinson. Limited to just five points in this contest. Entered averaging better than 20. Gray on the run out, denied. Jeremy Lin was there for the block. Mad Ants led by eight at the break. 
Santa Cruz plus three in the third. But within that, there have been some massive swings. Santa Cruz trailing by 20 in that third quarter before cutting into the lead. A chance for Santa Cruz to tie. They'll take two instead. Reese throwing it for Mawagbe. His star skyrocketed with that run for the New York Knicks in January and February of 2012. He was assigned to the G League. Axel Tupan. A lot of minutes out of those three. Eight points since that time. But we are tied at 94, second tie. Dusty Hannes makes that short lift. Took their first lead of the game late in this fourth quarter. A chance to extend it. End of shot clock. Lynn firing and connecting. Jeremy Lynn wants to make it back through the to the NBA, believing the G League is his best route. Brima, offensive rebound, and the putback is good. Jordan Poole on assignment from Golden State. Inside Brima, another field goal in the paint. Josh Gray lays it in. Our third tie of this quarter. Numbers the other way. Brissett, end to end, short. Pushing to Lynn. He'll step into a three and got it. Scratched yesterday with back soreness. Did not start this afternoon but has come off the bench with 25 big ones. Lynn using the screen on the pull up. No good. Resume and that was the appearance with Erie back in January of 2012 right before Lynn Sanity. Both teams in the bonus. Pool operating foul line jumper rolls in. Brissett has to fire and cans it. 109-105, the lead for Santa Cruz. Josh Gray driving in, gets the bucket. Matching the single sight high of Malachi Flynn of Raptors 905. They do not sub, although they could have. They're not allowed to huddle. Four point game, LeCue, the layup. Ahmad Carver of Memphis both had 35 earlier this week. Now Jordan Poole with 36. This is day nine of 25 of game action. Got 37, lead is four. Fort Wayne out of timeouts. Launching at the end of the game, and that'll do it. 113, 109.